Hi everybody, my name is Adi and today I'm going to learn uh, I'm going to teach you how to make a ball game on scratch. So first uh, I'm going to uh, pick the backdrop. So I'm going to choose the backdrop which is neon tunnel, yes, neon tunnel. And then the sprite is going to be I'm going to first pick paddle. I'm going to search for paddle. Paddle, yes, this is paddle. And to program the paddle, I want it to move uh, and I want it to move by the control of our mouse pointer. So I'm going to add when the green flag is clicked, and I'm going to add a forever loop. Forever loop. Forever loop, like that, sorry. And I'm going to go to not random position, I just want to choose it. Uh, I want it to go to mouse pointer, and it will be controlled by the mouse pointer. So it will be like this. See the paddle moved by its mouse pointer. Okay, next sprite is going to be the ball. The ball uh, is yellow. Right. Wait, yes, the ball. And I'm going to add it uh, when green flag is clicked. I wanted to go to. I wanted to go to X twenty and Y one hundred fifty. And then I wanted to point in direction. 45 what interaction 45 40, 45 that's it I'm going to add another forever loop and I wanted to move move 15 steps move 15 steps and if it's on the edge if it's on the edge if it's on the edge of the stage area if it's on the edge of the stage area i want it to bounce so it will be like this like that it will bounce forever so yeah next i go but uh, when uh it starts the paddle just standing there and with the ball hits the paddle it did nothing so we're going to i want to make it when uh, the ball when the ball hits the paddle i want it to bounce so uh, i will add another when oh and green flag is clicked and add a forever loop so it will do that forever and i'm going to add an if if loop so i'm going to add another sensing so i wanted to if the ball hits the paddle it will bounce so if the ball touching if the ball is touching the paddle it will bounce uh, I, I wanted to bounce and play sound going. I, I wanted to play sound hey, not until down. I wanted to play sound start sound going. Start sound going like that. And then I wanted to turn turn 100 180 degrees. After that I want to change its color effect. Change color pack. Change color pack by 25 and wait and wait it for one second. Let's start the, if it works. That's like that. It's going so. Uh, basically, from the code, the paddle is moving in the control of my mouse pointer. And if the paddle, if the ball hits the paddle, it will bounce and change its color. So there is, this game is quite boring, but uh, it's quite simple for beginners. So it's a, bit, a little bit boring. So let's make it a little more excited by adding more balls. How do you add more? How do you add more balls? You just need to duplicate the ball, duplicate, and duplicate, duplicate. So yes, yeah, so let's start. So you use only one ball. I know why it's only one ball because it's like, when I started, when I start the green flag. It actually position the ball position is the same as the other ball, so I need to change the position. Yes, so for ball three, I'm going to change the position into sixty and sixty and Y one hundred like that. And for ball two, I'm going to change it into forty and it's going to be one hundred twenty. Let's see, let's just say seventy five. So yeah, that's a little. There are three balls. You can add as much as many balls you wanted. 
Uh, and you can even develop it. Developable. I can even make other games uh, like this with a, with a score. You want to add a score? I'll teach you how. So give me a second. I'll just stop. And I'm going to add a score. So when the green flag is clicked, we're going to add another variable. And it's score. Uh, yes. I'm going to set score. Set set score into zero and for ball for every ball if uh, it's touching if it's touching the pedal I want it to change the score by one uh, let's just say yeah, change change score by one uh, I love other balls to change change score one and this one to change score by one. Check and let's test it. So yes, you see the score keeps rising. Every time, so every time the ball hits the panel, it will change score by one. It's quite fun. The sound is quite fun. And this this ball, these two ball here is just stick it together like that and I'm going to, I think I'm going to oh it's, it's done just like that uh, so yeah this is all for today's tutorial about ball game so thank you for watching guys I hope you enjoyed the video and don't forget to like subscribe and comment okay see you